I can't fuck with snakes. I ain't all the way back from my people. I pray I was I ain't. for fame. I'm finna turn up and get they ass a taste. I thought taste. I was global. They screaming my name. I'm everywhere like I'm the Chicago way. Way. I'm a, I got this next segment, man. I call it the GDs in the door session. So uh, I want to ask you, are the GDs in the door? Uh, as far as what? Like in the door, how? Like in the door as far as getting to like a certain point people thought they wasn't going to get to. Yeah, I ain't going to lie. I think like, uh, I don't know me personally, right? I just didn't never believe in that. In the black ball shit. So like it was just like I don't know, like it just won't don't be a motherfucker time. Like if it was if my father was black ball motherfucker, Duck couldn't have got no deal. It was just I ain't gonna say Duck them shit was garbage or nothing. Like that shit was decent, but Duck had never made no song like Slag. And when Slag came out, that shit then it then it taken right out of the You said what? Like when Slide came out, like I'm saying, like I ain't never heard no shit from Doug that was like Slide. Like Slide was his best song, and Ed motherfucker like went crazy when that shit came out. Yeah, and then I'm like, shit, like that's why I ain't really believe in the black ball shit. It was just like niggas had never had no song like that. You uh, know what I'm saying? Yeah, For, they didn't have that 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 big hit, is what you're saying? Right, niggas had never came up on that shit like. He was working for a long time, and then that shit popped for him. And I'm like, okay, yeah, but if if, the, if a motherfucker was just over black ball, then shit, I don't see how you feel me that how that would have got through. The, okay. the new that shit was undeniable. They had to let that shit through. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So as far as the GDs, like, like how did they get in the door, and how, and how could they stay in the door? Shit, I think motherfucking like. Shit like slide what did for him. Doug knocked that dough down for him for real. Like he and he was consistent. He was consistent with the shit he was doing. He was per- persistent, steady dropping, like trying to, you know what I'm saying, trying to come up, which is what you gotta do. You gotta try to outwork these niggas like and shit. He was sort of let him in. I don't know, I don't know if it'll ever be a cause he passed, so like I think the nigga Ruga, I think he raw, like, you know what I'm saying? Some of his shit, I I think his shit good. I just don't know, like, if musically, you know what I'm saying, how far to go without, like, being able to work with certain motherfuckers. Like, you know, like, say, like, with, like, Drake, you can't work with Drake because he's sort of under the Lil Dirk act. You feel me? Mm-hmm. So so I don't know. It's like, that shit, it's just hard. Motherfuckers got to try to keep pumping them hits out, shit, for real. That's what the motherfuckers got to do, in my opinion. Makes sense. But shit, I think motherfuckers should keep doing it. like them vlog, that vlog shit. J Man doing that shit, that shit wrong. I fuck with that. Okay, and I'm glad you like, mentioned. I, I think, yeah. yeah, I think a nigga could. I think not because that shit undeniable. Nigga can't stop that type of shit. If, so if it is a black bottle, my motherfucker, my, shit, that motherfucker, obviously my fuck can't stop that shit. Cause shit, J Man shit going up. Most definitely. And you and you just mentioned blackballing, so I got this next segment. I call it the blackball preach. So I want to ask you: Do you believe blackballing is real? No, um, I believe it's real, like to an extent. Like, shit, a motherfucker can't a motherfucker stop you from doing certain shit, but they can't they can't stop it for real. Like, you, they can't stop it. It's too many avenues for you to be able to get your shit out here. Like, what's that? Like, shit, you might have to motherfucking. See, my father say a black ball is because you gotta work harder than a, like you gotta work way more harder probably than dude or well, the nigga you think work to get to where you're going. But shit, man, if a motherfucker really want to put all they bread and, and say shit, ain't no black ball if you got your own money. Motherfucker run a bag, run a bag up and, and put it into their project, and then shit, a motherfucker see the difference. You get what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I think a lot of motherfuckers be be looking at black ball like, oh, well, I ain't get signed to this people. No, oh, gang shit. It, 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 they don't mean you black ball. You black ball from that arena right there. Go to the next one. You feel me? Okay. So like, as far as like, like when when someone is being black ball for, from a specific thing, it's like who is doing the black balling? I don't know, but that's what I'm saying. Like it's like even with the because I just give me an example of some shit you think is a black ball. Shit, when like I could say when uh, let me really think for a second. I could say like when six nine had like 
come back, came back home, and then like you ain't see no music outlets, you know, promoting his music, putting him on, putting him on playlists, you know, shit like that. Mm -hmm. I could call that what? a black boy. Okay, but could you call? Uh, so did you call that a black ball or do? Can you call that that the budget ain't there no more? Shit, it could be. It could be either. I don't know. Cause, oh, cause it's like it's like shit. At the end of the day, niggas do know it's the entertainment business, so you gotta pay for a lot of the shit that you're doing. So I bet he don't. He he didn't just told on some motherfuckers. He lost the street. I don't know if he lost the deal or not, but shit, the publicity he worked. It was like that. It was like it seemed like they snatched the budget to try to figure out what, how can we move further next? You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Because once he's decided to come back out on some, this is why I want to tell my story type shit. Yeah, my fuck was picking that shit up. The music stopped because the street stopped fucking with that shit. And the shit won't believe no more. And mm -hmm. shit, I think at that time when the when the blogs and shit stopped fucking with them, it wasn't really a black ball. It was like shit. Once you, it's okay. So, like, think about with the DJs and shit. They were saying the DJ stop playing that shit. Boom, Master Flex or something like that shit. Mm -hmm. Boom, I bet. But these DJs is connected to probably Shoddy, connected to them other niggas. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. So, shit. And the budget ain't there no more. So, either if you, you ain't uh, spending the money to uh, spend his music, you done told to. What the fuck? I'm gonna just keep this shit in rotation for. Oh, bro. Like, I think, like, shit. It's just. To me, the music industry and shit is more so about money than more than black ball, bro. Like, okay. Okay. If you got if you if you if you invest in enough money into yourself and, and into the shit that you need to be doing, ain't no nigga black ball. You you don't this like nigga saying you can't black ball motherfucking NBA young boy. Shit, he black ball you can say he black ball from billboard and all that other shit. Man, that man doing numbers on YouTube, just off his off his fan base. Yeah, yeah. And that shit monetizing. So shit, ain't no that ain't no black ball. He's still rich as hell on music. For sure. Numbers don't lie. Oh bro. For sure, man. I got this next segment, bro. I call it rapper turn blogger. And you just you just spoke on that. So I wanna ask you, would you become a blogger? <laughs> 